Assalamualaikum. My name is Rahisha. Hi students, welcome to our new GS class. Do you like the GS subject? Oh yes, it is very interesting subject that deals with our surroundings and its phenomena. Now we have to go through our first chapter. First chapter, know the plan world closely. That's our chapter name. Do you like the plants and trees? Oh yes, okay. Then what did you eat today? Ah, just like chapati, patiri, put. Then velapam. Okay, in the case of chapati, how to make a chapati? Chapati made from wheat. Where we get wheat? Wheat, we get wheat from plant. Okay. In this we can understand in each and every food items we get from plant. Okay. What is the main part of the plant? Root, stem, leaf, flower, seed. These are the main parts of the main part of the plant. Okay. Now we have to discuss the usage of plant. In all of the, in every human beings in the world, mainly depend upon the plants for what purpose? For food, depend upon the plants for food, okay? The first usage of plant is used as a food, okay? Then, uh, do we use the, all the parts of the spinach for food? No, uh, which part? Leaf and uh, stems are the spinach. Main part of the spinach used for food. Okay. okay. Then each and every plants in this world are different edible parts. Edible, edible parts means the eatable parts. That is called edible parts. Okay. In the case of cauliflower, in which part we use? Ah, the flower part. Okay. In the case of pea, we use the leaf and Seeds, okay. In the case of beetroot, we use the root parts, okay. In each and every plants, the edible parts are different. And the first use of plant is the plant used as a food purpose. Then next, the plant used as a spices, spices purpose, okay. Next uses is spices, okay. Spices means pepper. Cloves, ginger, chilli, coriander powder, cardamom, cinnamon. These are the commonly used spices. Okay. These are the spices. Spices adding into the food. We get taste and good color. Okay. Then here the plant used as a spices. Next plants used as a medical purpose. Just example. Panikurka, Kurundoti, Neem, Curry Leaf, Tulasi. These are the then eucalypts. These are the commonly used a medicinal plant. In the case of Panikurka and Tulasi, we use it uh, for what purpose? In the case of fever and a cough. Then hibiscus used it as a shampoo purpose. Then Turmeric. Turmeric we use it as a cosmetics purpose. Okay. Sometimes most of the spices use it as a medicinal purpose. Chala samyangala namala spices neyum medicine aite use here under. Do you understand? So, here we discuss the main usage of plant. First use. The, here the plant used as a food purpose. Next purpose is, next usage is spices. Plant used as a spices. Then plant used as a medical purpose. Okay. Then can we imagine a world without plants? No. plants on the world. Each and every human beings and animals mainly depend upon the plants for what purpose? For food purpose. Okay. Then, where did the plants get food? The plants food The plants prepare their food by the process of photosynthesis. By the process of photosynthesis. Did you hear the word photosynthesis? 
the plants prepare their food by the process of photosynthesis in the case of photosynthesis the plants absorb carbon dioxide from the atmosphere and absorb water from the soil using the root then in the presence of chlorophyll and sunlight the plants make their food this process is called this process is, is called photosynthesis then chlorophyll chlorophyll present present into the leaves okay the green color namaku ariya ee plant inde leaves nu parayumbo main aayite nammal common aayite kaanana green color laan that color a green color pigment pigments nu parayna peraanu chlorophyll the green color pigment is called chlorophyll adu the leaves absorb the sunlight from the atmosphere ee photosynthesis ne synthesis ne photosynthesis ne avashyamayittulla ee sunlight ne ke absorb cheyyunnathu mainly which part the leaves leaves absorb the sunlight from the atmosphere you understand what do you mean by photosynthesis plants prepare their food by the process of photosynthesis in the case plants absorbing carbon dioxide from the surrounding and absorbing water from the soil and using chlorophyll and sunlight the plants prepare their food this process is, is called photosynthesis okay by the product of photosynthesis we get glucose and oxygen what is the product of photosynthesis glucose and glucose and oxygen are the product of the product of the photosynthesis then all of you look at the board photosynthesis firstly absorbing carbon dioxide carbon dioxide and which one the yeah water in the presence of in the presence of sunlight and sunlight and chlorophyll then what is the product of this process we get the product is which one glucose and oxygen are the glucose and oxygen are the product of photosynthesis okay then the glucose later converted into in the form of starch that stored the all the parts of the plant chala so, ee starch nu parayunnathu plants inde sometimes root illo leaf illo flower illo ittana mainly store cheyunnathu is store cheyda food aanu nammal mainly use cheyunnathu did you get it okay in the case of photosynthesis the gases extension take place into the leaves yeah early studied carbon dioxide carbon dioxide absorbing from the surrounding sand release the oxygen the gases extension take place into the leaves through the small pores through the small pores into the leaves that is called stomata that is called stomata okay the small pores contain into the leaves that is the small pores contain into the leaves that is called stomata here the gas extension take place in which part gas extension take place into the leaves in which part yeah stomata in which part into the leaves that part is called stomata the small pore is called stomata stomata means small pores cheriya cheriya sushirangal undavu leaves la small pores il vechittana gas extension nadakkunnathu aa parts nu parayna peraanu stomata okay during the photosynthesis take place at the day time day time il aanu mainly photosynthesis nadakkunnathu during the photosynthesis absorbing carbon dioxide and releasing releasing in which gas releasing oxygen at the day time okay the photosynthesis does not take place at the at the night time 
photosynthesis does not take place during the night time oxygen is not released at that time okay in photosynthesis the plants absorbing in which gases carbon dioxide and and releasing oxygen okay we know in all in every human beings and including every human beings including plants and animals mainly respire respire means ഈ റെസ്പിയർ മീൻസ് മീൻ ചെയ്യുന്നത് നമ്മൾ അല്ലേ സാധാരണ കോമൺ ആയിട്ട് നമ്മൾ ഹ്യൂമൺ ബീൻസ് ആയാലും ബ്രീത്തിങ് ചെയ്യുന്നുണ്ട് അതുപോലെ ബ്രീത്ത് ഔട്ട് എടുക്കുന്നുണ്ട് നമ്മൾ ബ്രീ നമ്മളുടെ ശ്വാസം പുറത്തു പോകുന്നുണ്ട് അതുപോലെ എന്ത് ചെയ്യുന്നുണ്ട് ശ്വാസം ഉള്ളിലേക്ക് ഇൻടേക്ക് എടുക്കുന്നുണ്ട് ആ പ്രോസസ്സിനെ പറയുന്ന പേരാണ് റെസ്പിയർ ഓക്കെ ഡ്യൂറിംഗ് ദ റെസ്പിറേഷൻ ഓൾ ദി പ്ലാന്റ്സ് ആൻഡ് ആനിമൽസ് ഇൻ എവ്രി ഹ്യൂമൻ ബീൻസ് എബ്സോബ് ഇൻ ഓക്സിജൻസ് ആൻഡ് റിലീസിംഗ് releasing carbon dioxide respiration de time il nammal absorb cheynathu oxygen eyum release cheynathu edineyane carbon dioxide edilu maatrana nammal carbon dioxide absorb cheynathu photosynthesis in the case of photosynthesis only absorbing carbon dioxide and releasing oxygen in the case of respiration all every all organism in taking oxygen and given out carbon dioxide okay then all the leaves are seen in into the same color now some of the leaves seen into the green color yellow color red color yellowish red color uh, then early and told the green color the pigment give color to the leaves stem flower and fruit the green color pigment is called chlorophyll green color pigment is called chlorophyll did you hear the name chlorophyll chlorophyll gives the green color into the leaves then next the yellow color in yellow color xanthophyll gives yellow color into the leaves xanthophyll gives in which color yellow color then endocyanin gives red color into the leaves then carotin carotin gives yellowish red color into the leaves here we discuss the mainly four pigment chlorophyll endocyanin xanthophyll carotin chlorophyll gives green color xanthophyll gives yellow color then carotin gives yellowish red color endocyanin gives red color into the leaves these are the four pigments commonly we see we are seen in this world okay okay then i hope all of you understand in this class in first one we discuss the main uses of plants plant used as a plant used as a food purpose and plant used as a spices and plant used as a medical purpose by the process of food making in which process yeah photosynthesis in this process plants make their food and absorb in carbon dioxide and the presence of water in the presence of water sunlight chlorophyll in the presence of water then sunlight chlorophyll plants make their food is called photosynthesis then plants make their food their own is known as autotrophs plants prepare their own food is known as autotrophs okay then Uh, the gas extension take place through this small pore that is called that is called stomata okay the small pores present into the leaves that is called stomata and we discuss about the different pigment yellow pigment chlorophyll the chlorophyll gives green color xanthophyll gives yellow color endocyanin gives red color carotin gives yellowish red color into the leaves okay i hope all of you understand in this class okay in this class you have a work collect the familiar medicinal plants and paste 
in your GS notebook. Okay, we have to see you in the next class. Inshallah, Assalamu alaikum.